All right, Pizza Holics, it's the video you guys have all been waiting for. We are going to be doing the top five countdowns of season one pizza reviews, and it starts now. <laughs> YG Pizza Reviews. All right, Pizza Hogs, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. We are here to unveil the number one pizza in season one here in Edmonton. And it starts now. All right, guys, we are back for another season in 2020. This is the first review of the 2023. Happy New Year's, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Ukrainian New Year's. And guess what? We're filming this on Chinese New Year's, so I had to find the one place I knew be the most reliable place on earth well not on earth but in Edmonton is obviously Tony's Pizza I've done this on my, my original beta testing and it's one of my favorite pizzas of all time oh by the way happy birthday to JR a, a week ago yeah a week ago yeah happy birthday to JR we are at Tony's and I'm telling you right now I can smell the excitement and uh, <laughs> look at that too bad uh, Martin Zuckerberg hasn't done the whole smelling thing on Metaverse because it smells fantastic. It looks fantastic. I know exactly how this pizza is going to go. I wish they'd cut it a bit more. I wish they cut it a bit more. Cut it all the way. A little floppy, but you know what? I know it's going to taste good. Oh my god! Mmm! No, come on in. <laughs> okay, bro. This is raw. <laughs> oh you finally tried it. Which one no, did you order? Margarita. Margarita. Okay. And what did you What did you think? First bite. We haven't gone there yet. Okay. We That's haven't got there. Right. This is my physiotherapist, right. good friend. Hey guys. We are doing. We're doing. We're doing. I had a interview. Sal's Deluxe. I ordered a large Sal's Deluxe. Yeah. Eight slices. I finished six. Mm. Ten out of ten. Mm. Top place in Edmonton, in my opinion. Let's see what Ryan has to think. It's very cool. Yeah. Just have a little slice. No, oh, that's good. Man. Come on, Ryan. You gotta give me a four. I have one. Okay, I'll have, I'll have a bite. Bite. You have a bite. I have a bite. Bite. Is this one here? Yeah. Okay, let's see. You gotta give me a score, Raj. You get to use decimal points. Decimal points. Nine five, it's nine six, it's up there. What do you think? It's it's up there. It's up there. I don't Good. know about like nine and five. Yeah. Just because I think once I go to Italy and New York, I might run into those nine five, nine sixes. Yeah, yeah, okay. But this Same, is definitely some parable. Yeah. Mind That's you, great. I think there's only two places so far. We have like eight. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now I'm telling you right now, this thing doesn't belong in the eights. It definitely belongs in the nines. <laughs> okay guys, enjoy. Thank I'll you so much. For Enjoy. Honor. Quest, uh, thank you. Pivotal physio. <laughs> thank you. Thank All you, right. man. That's my, I guess I got a first guest review. <laughs> <laughs> All right, where are we going? Pizza, pizza, pizza. I'm telling you, man, this is the greatest pizza of all time. I even not been here today. Never. <laughs> Never. Now you know. I mean, like, I'm going to ask a lot of you. This part of town isn't that great, but it's totally worth it to come here. I mean, look at it. It's Sunday. This place is packed. Like crazy. I like it's for a good reason. I like the crunch, man. It's like perfect. Oh, I gotta focus here. I'm also too addicted to this thing here. Um, yeah, I, I gotta think about this. Again, this is probably one of the best pizzas in town here. JR's never seen me this excited in all the pizza reviews here. At all. He's shaking his head. It's like, yep. Yeah, I, I gotta give it a 9.1. I'm gonna give him the Evander Kane. The first ever person, the first, the first ever place here in Edmonton deserves a nine above. It's definitely Tony's. It's totally worth coming here. I mean, that's my review, like 111th, 111th out of Ed. 96th Street, 96th Street, 96th Street and 111th out. There we go. Bon Appetit, Happy New Year's, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Ukrainian Christmas, Happy Chinese New Year's. And happy birthday to JR, the camera guy. All right, JR. Number one. By the way, for you diehard Oilers fans like I am, when I say number one, is like when Jacques Plante wore number one in Montreal. Okay? I mean, he's a, he's a GOAT. I mean, how can you take pucks 
flying towards you. <laughs> well, I mean, you you yes. deserve goat status, man. For real, that's all crazy. those all those old school hockey goalies. My golly, my golly. No, that's crazy. That's wild. That never. You won't catch me doing that. That's for sure. That's uh, wild. For sure. Well, Jr. and I know exactly what it is. Some of you may know, but the number one place is Tony's. Yeah. My favorite. Did you know what score I gave it? <laughs> uh, you didn't give it a 10, did you? Did you give it a 10? Did not give it you a 10. You didn't give it a 10, no. Because I know there's probably somewhere in Italy or somewhere that's, that's going to blow my mind. Oh, yeah, we're going to get another 10 somewhere. But what did you give it? We'll give Vander Kane. Oh. oh, just see the foreshadowing? <laughs> 9.1. 9. 9.1. That's still pretty high. That's the highest so far, right? Seeing that we barely get any eights, like yeah, yeah. nine point one is a massive honor. <laughs> <laughs> no, that that was yeah, Tony's was crazy. Um, then the wait time wasn't too long either, so it was worth it. And the location is like, well, I mean, like inside. Sorry, I should say the atmosphere was really like welcoming and really like yeah, accepting and really like just cool inside just to look around and check it out, right? So, yeah. Some of these places we go to are pretty interesting when we go into because you think it's just a regular pizza spot until you walk in and you see it you're like oh well for me anyways I'm like wow yo this is crazy this is this is wild I think you that's know? I think that's what absolute vibe like you know you start off like off on a bad foot you get in there it has a kind of this whole like Sopranos look to this place <laughs> like you, yeah you think you're going to, like meet the mob or something but yeah I mean I mean it's the greatest pizza best bang for your value best taste. Good service, yeah. great ticket time. There's really nothing really they can do to improve it. Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe like make the parking lot bigger. That's probably <laughs> the only thing I. That's the, probably the only thing I can think of. Like, mm -hmm. do I expect the owner to drop a quarter million to start changing the building? Probably not. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I mean, yeah, it's, it's pretty good. And then you end up uh, meeting one of your friends there as well, which was kind of crazy. Rosh, yeah. yeah. I couldn't see him. It was Chinese New Year. It was like dead dark. Like. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's a hundred eleven street. You don't want to be shouting out to people you don't. You're not one hundred percent sure on. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I... It was actually uh, kind of funny because uh, in the restaurant he was eating. Uh, you were sitting uh, facing me, and he was behind you the whole time. You didn't know some notice him at all. And we got up and left. And then the way you got up, your back was to him anyway, so you still wouldn't notice him. And then when we got outside, he was um, he was leaving. I could, could see him in the background. I was just thought, you know, regular person, whatever, like nothing to it. And then he's walking by, and you notice him. You're like, hey, yo, Raj. And then yeah, then he ended up being part of the video. So that was kind of crazy because in the restaurant, I was seeing him the whole time and looking at him the whole, the whole time and didn't think nothing of it, right? Because I didn't know him at the time, right? And then well, yeah. it just goes to show how much energy it takes out here in Chinese yeah. New Year's. So like you're you're all over the place with old cleaning and you're. Long time to do this, do that. So yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. Tony's number one. Um, mm -hmm. yeah, Tony's is Tony's is good. I like Tony's a lot. Yeah. It was really good. Basil, the cheese presentation, the cut. I don't know. I mean, yeah. It is. It's if you if you want to ex excel here in the pizza world, like take Tony as an example. Mm -hmm. So yeah. And it wasn't greasy. That was another big thing. It wasn't greasy. It wasn't a lot of greasy. these places are greasy. This place wasn't greasy. You couldn't just hold the slice up and watch it drip down. It was like wasn't greasy at all it was good you know so because a lot of times if you get a slice and you rather you crunch it up or however you eat it you know and you can just drip the grease off there was none of that there right so it's really good and yeah and it, it is italian or no it is italian, yeah. yeah okay always yeah italian style since i think 93 i'm not mistaken so oh damn okay okay and yeah. it's been in the same location for a while i, I believe i yeah. believe it's still the original location so yeah i mean congrats to tony so mm -hmm. yeah. so what made you though rate that number one like when was the first time you tried it during COVID, actually, when I came up with the idea of the show, I was like, I was like asking people around, and uh, yeah, no, I was sitting up, you know, watching uh, pizza reviews on uh, on Barcelona Sports with Dave Porno, seeing that I get criticized being called Asian Porno, I'm like, sure, why not? You know, so you just, that's when you start to run with it. Yeah. So that's where you got the whole premise of from going to Tony's. Is where you got the whole premise of Tony's and Barcelona Sports together is how you got the premise of this. Yeah. So nice. I mean, nice. It's a perfect collusion of. Stuff, yeah. And then you met the cool guy Jr. and it just you know excelled, you know. So <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no, that's good. That's good because yeah, Tony's is definitely some. I was gonna say it's something like inspiring that you like. If you because we're doing a pizza review, if you're just eating it normal, of course it'd be normal. But it's inspiring eating it as like t um to give it a rating or to test it or try it. For me, it was the first time eating there to to test it out to try it. So it's definitely inspiring. Like oh yo, this is a really good pizza like. 
you know, we got to come here or, or let's compare this to this place. Let's compare it to this place. So it was, yeah, that experience was, was pretty cool, you know? So, yeah. But it's your number one pick, eh? It's our number one pick. But that's for season one. That's for, of season one, one. sorry. Yeah. Can they hold the top spot for season two and season three? No, we're going to find Hit out. Hit the like soon. and subscribe to find out. <laughs> well pizza holics that's the conclusion of season one hit the like and subscribe stay tuned for season twos for the shorts the instagrams the tiktoks and every other platform that we have stay tuned <laughs>